Lesson number two, realistic characters versus fantasy characters. Yesterday, we started talking about realistic fiction and the story elements in every realistic fiction book we read or write. Story elements are characters, setting, problem, and solution. Today, we'll look closely at characters. We'll learn the difference between realistic characters and fantasy characters. Realistic characters are characters that can exist in real life. Fantasy characters cannot exist in real life. They are pretend. Hmm, here's a chart. Realistic characters. Oh, a farmer and a grandma are the examples. They can exist in real life and they do things that are possible in real life. Fantasy characters. They show a mermaid and a unicorn. Yeah, they're make-believe. They don't exist in real life. They can do things that real people and real things can't do. An example of a realistic character you may know is Peter from The Snowy Day because he acts like a real person from real life. An example of a fantasy character that you may know, oh, Elephant and Piggy, they're both fantasy characters because real elephants and pigs don't talk and they don't do the things that these two do. So Elephant and Piggy are not realistic, but Peter is. Now it's your turn. Think of realistic characters and fantasy characters that you know. Think about books that you've read or books that have been read aloud to you. Think of characters who are realistic hmm. and characters that are fantasy. Then take out your notebook and make two lists with pictures. It should look like this. One list should say realistic characters. And you could write down three examples and draw their pictures. Then write fantasy characters. Give three examples and draw their pictures. When you're all done, remember to take a picture or submit this somehow to your teachers. We want to see how you're thinking. Talk to you soon.